20 years later, survivors along with friends and family of the fire that claimed 100 lives still come together to remember that fateful night in West Warwick. Though the station nightclub fire happened in February 2003, a service was held by the Station Fire Memorial Foundation today. 12 News reporter Lauren Brill joins us live from Station Memorial Park in West Warwick with more details from today's ceremonies. Well, family, friends, survivors, and public officials came together today here at the Station Fire Memorial Park. And many tell me they remember that night like it was yesterday. Andrea Mancini, 28, from Johnston. You could hear a pin drop as the 100 names of those who lost their lives in the Station Nightclub fire were read one by one. They will never, ever be forgotten. And it is our mission and with this park that you all never forget and we keep their spirits alive. Former Rhode Island Governor Don Kachiri says although it's been 20 years, he remembers that night and the days following like it was yesterday. Etched on my brain and in my heart forever is the pain and the agony of that wait for the dreaded news for those families. Although February marked the 20 year anniversary of the tragedy, survivor and president of the Station Fire Memorial Foundation, Gina Russo, tells me they decided to wait until spring. Couldn't have asked for a better day and the families that are here, they just deserve this moment in this place. With the sun shining, a new monument was unveiled with hearts to represent the 100 angels and a plaque commemorating the 20th anniversary. Russo says today is special because it has not always been easy for survivors and victims families to come together. It's a combination of survivors and angels families, which is very rare. Um, it, it wasn't didn't happen early on that the victims family members and the survivors was kind of a big divide. So when they come together on this site, everybody's neutral and it's in its peaceful joining together at the site of where the club once stood a place to honor and remember those lost in the fire and its survivors. Um, I lost a fiance that night and um, so to know that this was his last spot and all these other um, survivors and victims families and to know that they have a place um, not so tragic anymore. It's peaceful here. It means everything. Today also holds significance. May 21st is the six year anniversary of the park opening. Reporting live in West Warwick, Lauren Brill, 12 News.